find the indicated limit, the limit of e to the 4x minus 1 minus 4x all over x to the second as x approaches 0. To find the limit, we need some information as you could see on the side. e to the 4x is graphed right here. And when you plug in 0, you get e to the power 0, which is 1. That's this point right here. And we'll be using L'Hopital's rule, which has different formats. But the main thing is infinity over infinity or 0 over 0 form. And we'll apply the derivative to both f of x and g of x and take the limit. We'll be using the chain rule dy dx equals dy du times du dx. The derivative e to the x is e to the x, but the derivative of e to the u will be e to the u times u prime. Because we have e to the u as u being 4x. Also, the power rule when we apply it to x to the second. Now, what we have here is limit x approaches 0 of the following e to the 4x minus 1 minus 4x over x to the second. If you attempt to plug in 0 for x, the top part gives me e to the power 0, which is 1 minus 1, that's a 0 minus 4 times 0, which is 0. So it's going to give me a 0 on top. And in the denominator, it's x to the second or 0 to the second, which is 0. So we do have the limit has the form 0 over 0. Therefore, we could apply L'Hopital's rule. And that will equal to applying L'Hopital's rule, the limit as x approaches 0, the derivative of the top part, as we could see from here, the derivative of e to the 4x is e to the 4x times the derivative of 4x, which is 4. So let's write 4 up front. Minus 1 will be 0. Minus 4x, the derivative of minus 4x will be minus 4. And in the denominator, the derivative of the denominator or g prime of x is 2x. And if you attempt to plug in 0, I end up with e to the 4 times 0, which is 1, times 4. On top, it's going to be end up 4 times 1 minus 4, and that's a 0. Down, it's going to be 2 times 0. So we still have the same format or the same form 0 over 0. Of course, we can't write 0 over 0, but that's the form that we have, which means we could apply L'Hopital's rule, just because we are in this case right here. So let's apply L'Hopital's rule again. Limit x approaches 0 derivative of the top part will be 8 or e to the 4x times the derivative of 4x is another 4 and we have 4 up front that's going to make it 16 4 times 4 minus 0 over 2 now we don't need to write the minus 0 so let's cancel it This way we could save a step from writing and simplify between the 2 and the 16. Divide by 2, you get 1. Divide 16 by 2, you get 8. So now it's a limit as x approaches 0 of the fraction 8 
e to the power 4x over 1, which is the limit as x approaches 0 of 8 e to the power 4x. And that will be 8 times 1, as it shows in the graph, that the point 0, 1 right here. This point is 0, 1. And the answer is 8 by itself. And that should do it. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.